Hello friends, welcome to civil engineering exam. Today we are going to see the problem related with environmental engineering in the topic of water treatment. So the problem is chlorine usage in the treatment of 20,000 cubic meter per day is 18 kg per day. So the residual after 10 minutes of contact is 0.2 milligram per liter. Calculate the dosage in milligram per liter and the chlorine demand of the water. Okay. So in this problem, so the uh, treatment of uh, 20,000 cubic meter uh, per day, the chlorine required is 18 kg per day. So we have to find out the uh, chlorine dosage in milligram per liter. Okay. So per liter, how much quantity of chlorine is required for the treatment? Also, uh, the residual also uh, is 0.2 milligram per liter uh, in 10 minutes of contact okay so now the solution so now the water treatment per day is 20,000 cubic meter okay so now we have to convert into liters because uh, they are asking milligram per liter so now 20,000 into 10 power 3 liters okay so now 20 into 10 power 6 liters that is equal to 20 million liters okay so now uh, the chlorine required per day is uh, 8 kg so 18 kg so now 18 into 10 power 6 milligrams okay so we can convert into kg into grams and as well as milligrams so 10 power 6 so now uh, we having 18 million milligrams okay so now the chlorine used per liter so we can uh, calculate so per liter of water so now we can take 18 million milligrams per 20 million liters okay so now so now we got the value of 0 0.9 milligram per liter okay so the 20 million liters of water treated by 18 million milligrams of chlorine so now per liter we can uh, find out 0 0.9 milligram per liter is required okay so now the residual chlorine so so now actual chlorine demand is 0 0.9 milligrams is required minus 0 0.2 milligram per liter so the in residual uh, the 0 0.2 milligram uh, per liter of uh, chlorine is uh, come as residual so now the original so the actual chlorine is required 0 0.7 milligram per liter okay so this is the actual uh, chlorine demand so this is the method we can solve the problem again we will see next video thank you